taking an ambulance to the hospital is more than just transportation. It's about care and treatment. Our medical providers are trained extensively in multiple different situations. We can stabilize you en route to the hospital and also provide care and comfort en route to the hospital. There's multiple situations that would lead for you to call for EMS assistance. Mostly that'd be heart attack, stroke, severe car accident, any kind of life or death situation or any situation that would require you to have immediate medical attention. Warning signs would be any sudden chest pain, stroke-like symptoms, any change in mental status, any elderly person that's just not acting like their normal self, an allergic reaction, or any kind of major traumatic event. It may seem like a good idea to just hop in the car and take yourself or have someone drive you. We prefer that you activate 911 where we'll send an ambulance out to you. In critical situations, every minute counts. And when you call an ambulance and we transport you there, we're shaving off minutes that would other times be detrimental. We are the eyes and ears for the physicians on the front line and we report back to them all of our findings. We can do a rapid assessment, we can do a more thorough assessment. With our EKG monitoring device, we have transmission capability where we can actually send a copy of your EKG to the ER team and your cardiologist. We also have the same medications that the emergency room carries to stabilize you and get you more comfortable. So we're going to communicate with your care team, we're going to get you a quicker diagnosis, quicker treatment, and activate the operation room if needed. National response time average is 15 minutes, and we're under that at approximately 10 minutes. The unknown can be very scary and unsettling, and we're here to assure you that it can be a more enjoyable experience and it's all about providing you comfort and care.